The relationship between Cameron and Callum takes an unusual turn in chapter 1425 when they have a poignant yet amusing talk while driving. Callum jokingly proposes marriage but Cameron refuses, insisting that they are just friends and not a couple. She wonders why marriage is being discussed so quickly because it is a serious life event, not a game. Callum is unfazed and continues to insist that there is no requirement for romantic involvement prior to marriage, using Zachary and Serenity's happy union as an example. Due to her lack of words, Cameron wonders whether the other York family members' hectic schedules will cause them to take the quick route of a surprise marriage rather than follow Zachary's example. He shows that he and Cameron are dating each other while repeatedly offering to be her boyfriend. Cameron, however, kindly reminds him that a relationship of this nature requires her permission. Due to her blindness and their various social standings, she feels unworthy of Callum and thinks their elders will not approve of their union. Callum, who is adamant about marrying Cameron and rejects her doubts, promises her that he would alter his behavior to suit her. He acknowledges that he treats and views her as his wife. Cameron reiterates that she is blind and believes she would not be a good addition to their future union. Callum, however, is unconcerned about family perks since he recognizes the importance of having a loving wife and kids to make a cozy home. She is speechless in the face of Callum's perseverance and sincere sentiments. He responds by lightening the tone by humorously inquiring if she has her paperwork with her. He jokingly says that they might obtain a marriage license right away if her uncle wants him to take care of her once more. Cameron maintains her position on not dating and categorically rejects the notion of spontaneously marrying Callum. She protests but Callum jokes that their flowery exchanges are proof that they are dating. She doesn't want to talk about their relationship while Callum is there, which makes her amused but also flustered. He acknowledges in a sweet voice that he likes Cameron more and more each day and that he can't think of anything he doesn't like about her. She ponders her feelings for him in silence after learning this information. Finally, Callum is unclear about what to do and asks his friend Josh for guidance on how to capture Cameron's heart and make her want to marry him. The chapter highlights Cameron and Callum's funny yet tender relationship, revealing their developing love for one another. We are anxiously anticipating the following chapters to see how their connection develops because of the ambiguity and intricacy of their possible marriage.